hello friends welcome back to my channel in today's video we'll be learning how to paint grass and flowers ye video last jo series start ki thi acrylic painting tutorial ki usi ka continuation part hai yahan pe hum different types of flowers and grass kaise banana hai wo sikhenge so for that i have taken this green color this is uh, sap green color and you will also need yellow and white color so take flat brush like this take some green color hold it vertically like this and just give light pressure and such kind of strokes for grass and again in the bottom portion to make dense grass give such strokes and fill the gaps between the grass with the same green color and again give such strokes for grass holding brush vertically now we'll be drawing flowers flowers are basically there are variety of flowers so you can just uh, uh, draw flowers with the tip of brush like this take some any color you want i'm taking yellow color you can take white color or any color and just with the tip of brush i'm drawing some circular petals two three petals and in the center portion keep draw this uh, brown dots so for next flower we are painting tulip flower so for tulip flower you can draw with pencil or just paint this shape the first petal the second petal and it's done again the first petal the second petal and it's done now take dark pink color and just highlight the flower with the painting borders you can take a zero number brush and just with little bit of paint on that moist brush you just mark the outlines dark pink outlines and add some white color on the top to make it look more realistic for acrylic painting you always need to add highlights and shadows to make it more realistic now we'll paint rose for rose you just uh, draw such circular shape random a circular shape need not be circular exactly so draw such shape with a light pink color or whatever color you want to paint i am taking light pink color so just draw again like this and then take dark pink color on zero number brush and just draw petals like this center circular portion then just a random petals in half circular motion you have to draw and your rose is ready okay center circular and the half circular strokes for petals and your rose is ready like this just draw it randomly so it gives more realistic look now add some white highlights and again i am adding some darker shade to the center and adding some extra petals 
so like this you can draw rows now we'll paint daisy flower you take white color and with zero number brush I'm just drawing petals with the tip of the brush like this so like this you draw petals in the same tab you draw this yellow shade and over that yellow shade just put some brown dots to make it real now we'll be painting the leaves now there are again uh, different kinds of different shapes of leaves uh, for tulip leaves and for uh, the leaves of rose there are different shapes first you draw this stems of this flowers for that just add uh, some little bit of white color to the green color and draw these lines like this you need not to draw all the flowers in one paper actually aapko sare flowers ek hi jagah pe nahi निकालने हैं आई एम जस्ट टीचिंग यू द डिफरेंट शेड्स ऑफ फ्लावर्स आप इजीली कोई भी दो शेड्स अगर बैकग्राउंड में निकालते हैं कोई यू जस्ट ब्लेंड एनी टू शेड्स यू वांट इन द बैकग्राउंड एंड जस्ट पेंट बिग फ्लावर्स ऑफ रो रोज और जस्ट सिंगल बिग फ्लावर ऑफ टूलिप जस्ट बिग सिंगल फ्लावर ऑफ रोज यू कैन पेंट विद एनी बैकग्राउंड like like this you can make greeting cards or anything so uh, i'm painting all flowers in one canvas just to teach you so you can paint single flowers with any two shades of background now draw tulip leaves like this just a vertical stroke with long leaves like this vertical strokes long leaves at the tip you have to lift the brush and make shape like this again vertical strokes long leaves like this you can draw all the leaves of tulip flower or you can give random strokes in the grass for such leaves any kind of leaves i'm just making random strokes and with just a single flower with uh, such leaves also looks beautiful uh, like if you paint any two shades like if you have painted uh, orange color and with that you are, you, are, you are blending yellow color so in with these two uh, background shades or any uh, light color background shade you can choose and on that background you just draw or paint any single flower any single rose with leaves or any single daily flower with leaves it looks very beautiful or just daisy flowers are also very attractive in the green background so like this you can make greeting cards or uh, any if you want to give any gift to somebody so you can make such cards or just paint uh, on your book acrylic painting paper or just uh, in your drawing book you can draw or paint such flowers and make a good collection now we are painting 
leaves of rose so just touch the tip of the brush to the canvas like this and here are the leaves I'm just touching the tip of the brush to the canvas like this round leaves make random strokes uh, you can you need not be very uh, particular about the sh shape of the leaves and everything you just make random leaves shape don't bother about it's perfect or not so uh, over that shade over green shade i'm making highlights for highlights you choose either yellow color or light yellow color by adding white color to it or <clears throat> you just add like yellow color and over uh, after the yellow color is dried you add some white color strokes so for acrylic painting you uh, need to add highlights and shadows now what does it mean to make uh, acrylic painting more realistic agar acrylic painting realistic lage aap chahte to uh, you need to decide the uh, direction of the light if the light is uh, coming from uh, right side if you want to make it look like that so uh, on the right side of the every object like leaves and petals and everything you add uh, the lighter shade like uh, you have to add such white color strokes or light color uh, highlights to the right side and on the left side you need to add shadows like uh, darker uh, shade of the same color you have to apply on the left so it will look more realistic like in this painting i am adding white strokes to every stem and every leaf to all the stems and all the leaves i have applied this white color for highlighting highlighting means you are just adding the reflection of the light to that surface so like this add white strokes to the leaf and to petals to grass everything for acrylic painting white color is like uh, the perfect color for uh, adding highlights you just add white color strokes or uh, shades white color shade to any object you want to highlight or you want to show the light reflection over it you just add white color over top of it and it will look more realistic like this i am adding i am again adding some white strokes in the grass also so like this just by adding some white strokes it looks very beautiful and realistic so always remember in acrylic painting add lighter shade of the same color over top of it just one side of the object one corner of the object you choose for highlighting and apply it like this it will look more beautiful so here is painting is almost ready you can you can draw the same painting or you can draw just a single flower you can draw all the flowers uh, with the sa uh, same variety like all the roses or the tulips anything or just a single flower you can paint and please let me know in the comment section if you find something difficult or want something 
some techniques some tips i'll be helping you so for more videos and painting tutorials please check the description box below maine sare tutorials ke link description box mein diye so please check out that and also like this channel subscribe this channel and thank you so much for your love and support